when we were talking about the process of oxidation, everything is going higher on vibration. It's, it's just nature. Okay. And oxidation is a part of it. Uh, has not a judgment. This is what happened, good or bad. It's just what's happening. Forever? Forever. Ever and ever and the ever. Ascending of the frequency, it's something the, that is a part of life? It's, it's the, yes, the part of not life, part of everything. Part of Beyond life too. Forever. The whole universe goes up on a spiral, okay. energetic curve. And every moment is a nudge before that moment before. Okay. Of course, there's no such thing as time, but in the reality of time, this is what I'm explaining. And I can explain you in other reality how it is, but this is the reality that I'm explaining. Okay. So it goes up. The whole universe goes. Earth doesn't go to the same extent. The whole universe goes on this curve up like this. Earth goes up, but lagging behind. So it's become like this. Why? Maybe you you're going too fast. <laughs> you're going like this. So it's a gap always. And this gap is because of human lower vibration. We drag the earth to be lower vibration than the whole universe. Our vibration. Yeah. Our mental. We are not in the flow. So, so this gap happens. Every 7 times 2012 years, which is 14,000 and something, something happened on earth that it jumps back to where it is. Okay. Uh, well, it's like a correction. It's like a combustion. And then the same thing happened again for 14,000 something years, the same thing happened again. So Earth corrects itself. Every element of Earth goes, jump to the vibration that it can jump. And generally when it does, humanity cannot handle it. And then there is a destruction. That's right. But it's not, it's not happening for destruction. It's happening as a cycle of what it is. And then it starts again, it starts again, it starts again. But only now, even though you think it's so bad, this is the first time that you're going through this. This gap is so small, this much time. smaller than before. This time. Yes. Yes, yes. yes. And then there is a chance to do it without destruction. Yes, just some elimination. Yes. Uh, it's okay. I know of the sun elimination. It's okay. Yes. So it is happening without that destruction, without the elimination of of, of humanity. It just there's no. It's, you look at yourself as a destruction, but it's simple. If you need the energy of water to go in a higher level, you have to boil it. Okay. You see, the four elements that carries the, 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 every being on earth is earth. And if it goes to a higher vibration, it creates earthquakes. Water, it goes to a higher vibration, it creates tsunamis. Uh, fire, if you go to a higher vibration, it creates volcanoes. And air, when you go to a higher vibration, it creates the tornadoes. And when this happens, what we look at it is a disaster. But it's not happening to hurt you. It's just a part of that hair that we are getting a haircut. <laughs> But it is I mean, you don't cut your hair to, 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 to hurt it. That's the part of it. But it is a result of the human mind that caused the law of vibration, and the human mind and the ego are quite the same. And that yeah, is but it's, why it's a result of human mind, but it's not a result of, it's, it's a deeper than that. It's a result of human nature, which is part of every other nature, and the human mind is part of its nature. It's not a fault of human. It's nothing that can be changed or correct. Yeah, it can. No. Wait, wait, yeah. But hold on. The, the energetic of human, even though you think it's so terrible, is much better than before. So because of that, this gap is much smaller. And the first time in the history of humanity, there is a lot of energetic combustion happening, like what we do, like every other spiritual people doing, 144,000 people who are doing a spiritual work to bring everybody think, oh, uh, it's for me. It's not for you. It's everybody does what it does to bring that vibration. It's not just up so this gap is becoming smaller. So when it's time, it comes sure. to a time of correction, it's not so big. Sure. 
what's happening. This is, this is what's happening. There's nothing can change anything. There's nothing need to be changed. This is a process that is happening, and this time is already happening. It's happening, and this time that process is not going to be as more explosive to humanity as it used to be. And nothing can change it, and nobody can. And everybody, what they're doing, it, they, 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 as a result of it, they're not doing it to reduce it. I'm not doing what I do to reduce it. What? Humanity is not anybody's reality. In, 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 in nature, you think, you think a tiger, think about the, the whole uh, uh, child kingdom? No. Doesn't. You think the trees think about the tree kingdom? Why do you think any human would think about human kingdom? Because of their ego. Exactly. And their ego and their mind is what's slowing the vibration in the first exactly. place. Exactly. So if they would care, <laughs> that means they are really... If you are within your nature, the problem is that that's what exactly what you said. So if you want to help you in a way, right? Leave it alone. And then there will be no gap. There will be a gap. The gap is smaller, but not because of what we do or what we don't do. It's because our vibration is high, it's becoming higher and higher than before, and through that air it's going to a higher vibration. And it's not by action, it's by being. And by being is allowing. As more you want to do something, as less you're allowing. Actually, three months ago I sent a quotation, I don't know if you got it or not. The quotation was allowing is a journey to become enlightened. Allowing is a journey to become enlightened. But if you want to become enlightened, you are not allowing. <laughs> then you get to a point that uh, you cannot put anything into words. You just it's all about being. And it's not about changing anything or doing anything. It's allowing to be and allowing everything to be as they are. And if you allow, you are different vibration and that vibration affecting everything else. But even if you allow, you're not allowing because you want to affect everything else because as soon as you have that, then you are not allowing. Mm -hmm. You see the... Very equation. easily you step out of this, uh, or you so, get back into the equation, the limiting so equation. So the whole thing is being part of what it is, <laughs> and being an observer. And whatever is observed through you, the observed through you, whatever is not, is not. And not being an observer by choice that you are going to choose to observe this and not that. Is an observer that whatever comes in front of you, you look at. It is like a... When you have a wish or hopes of action and you're going to do things different, you're going to do this, it all comes from opposite, bringing the vibration lower. Action brings it lower. In this, in, it's in the equation. <laughs> and I do whatever I do because my nature mandated to do, not because I, I care about earth or humanity. And if I said I did care about humanity, I would lie. If I say I have compassion for every human being, I do. Then I say I have compassion for my children to future, I do. I have, I have compassion for everybody's future, I do. But the humanity gonna take the journey that the humanity gonna take. It is taking. That is the journey that Earth will mandate. So, am I gonna vote for humanity and reduce it, make Earth less important? Because I am a human. It's like, you know, if you look at the news, your if, if a cat in your city is stolen or whatever is in the first part of the news, and if somebody else is died in the other side of the world is the last one. Because the cat in your city is more important than a dead person in somewhere else. And the only relevance that we have is because I'm a human, is more important than humanity. It's not. The only thing makes it important is the human ego.
so we are ready to manipulate everything for humanity to benefit. Again, the same manipulation. What makes this vibration? That is manipulation. Has been manipulation. So the only way is to leave it alone. <laughs> leave it alone. <laughs> and if you cannot leave it alone, don't manipulate yourself to leave it alone. Accept again that you don't leave it alone. Then you might drop into leaving it alone. It's lower resistance. It's the it's, it's amazing how these things always come about uh, in, in the, again in the equations. You know, you have the Ohm's law, that the voltage is, is, uh, is the uh, resistance times the, the flux, the, the energy. So if you lower the resistance, you get more, uh, more food, lower the resistance, you get more, but it burns the body. So, but, but exactly what you said, because you don't understand what you said, but what we are doing is two resistance. We want to push, we want the higher resistance. We want to change the resistance to a way that pushes the, the hole, but it doesn't. We just have to cut it off. That's what it is. You know how many people they come and ask you what is the what is the way to, for us to become more connected to do what's the practice? What? <laughs> the only part that is not connected is your mind and you want to feed it to be more powerful. That's what it is. And everything is mine. And, and everybody asks me the same way. It's true everywhere, but it's mine. So, if you want to be the God and change things, no, I don't. I don't have to. I'm so I vote for you. But you know what? It's better for me to hear you talking and my mom And I don't see that. I don't care about the world and everything. The world is not me. No, because you can't.